If you're looking to buy a new car, prices are finally, finally going down, but that doesn't mean that you'll be paying less for your new ride. We're connecting the dots for you this morning. Why are lower car prices not a relief for consumers? Let's connect the dots. The pandemic and supply chain issues caused folks to pay well over the sticker price just to secure the car or truck they wanted. But with supply finally catching up to demand, Morgan Stanley's chief auto analyst says car prices are dropping. However, inflation now causing new car loans to shoot up. Edmunds data shows it's up nearly 1.5% from a year ago. And the Federal Reserve is expected to continue raising interest rates. So you can expect the rates for auto loans to continue to rise as well. That means while overall car prices should fall, monthly car payments might not. Nearly 15% of all new buyers have agreed to monthly loan payments of $1,000 or more. And that is Connecting the Dots. Mm, all right, some good information for you there. Mm.